hi guys so here is how to write your Fiverr gig description using chat gpt so the first step is to understand the you know template of a Fiverr gig description a Fiverr gig description should contain three things the first is an attention grabbing headline okay you need to have a headline that mentions the client's pain point the second thing is to show that you're the solution to that problem and then the third thing is to in include a call to action that tells your clients to send you a message okay so let's get into that with chat gpt now for the first step which is grabbing the attention you know i'm mentioning the client's pain point you want to click right here on new chat and then let's assume you have a writing gig on fiverr you tell chat gpt to write and now this is the difference between your um you know gig description and everyone else's while using chat gpt make sure you include adjectives okay so instead of saying write a fiverr gig description headline you tell ChatGPT to write an attention grabbing, okay, Fiverr gig description headline, okay. So this is a much better way of you know telling ChatGPT what to do. So click on enter, and then ChatGPT will come up with you know very good these are very very good headlines okay so if you were a graphics designer you just say um write an attention grabbing fiverr gig description headline for graphics design okay you can do this for any gig you have okay so right now i've shown you how to write okay transform your business with stunning and okay this is very good so right now i've shown you how to you know grab attention the next step is this you know to mention the client's pain point so let's use one of these okay um transform your website into a lead generation machine with conversion focused copy okay so we'll use this so let's say this is an article or content writing gig. Now we have written a headline. We just need to mention the client's pain point. Okay. So the next step is to tell Chat GPT to write a Fiverr gig description that mentions a client's pain points okay uh, sorry okay for a writing gig and click on enter and then you would see uh, okay can you see these are very very good um, you know pain points are you struggling to attract and retain customers on your website? Are you tired of bland, uninspiring writing that fails to engage your audience? Look no further. I mean, this is a very good, you know, um, um, pain point, okay? So now you've, you know, grabbed the attention and you've mentioned, sorry, and you've mentioned the client's pain point, okay? The next step is to show that you are the solution to that problem. Okay, so let's tell ChatGPT to write a Fiverr gig. Sorry. Uh, okay. Okay, write a Fiverr gig description. Sorry, I don't know why I'm having it is to tell chat GPT to write a Fiverr gig description that shows 
how I solve the pain points above okay so the good thing about chat GPT is that it remembers and understands you know the content you've written earlier okay so you just have to say the pain points above and chat GPT knows the pain points you're talking about you know uh, the pain points we wrote earlier so just click on enter and then you would have um, your content let's see okay so um, okay this is very good here's how I can help solve your pain points of course you may uh, decide to leave out this part you know this text right here and just you know copy all of these okay very very good okay so right here you have you know um, you've already shown the clients that you're the solution and the last is a call to action now you can write a call to action yourself or just tell chat GPT to write a call to action for my writing gig okay but I think it's much better to again like you talked about include adjectives so write a strong call to action okay for my writing gig all of these call to actions okay so the next thing to do is to just scroll up and then you know choose the specific parts that you want okay because right here we have different headlines okay we have different headlines right here you can use any of these headlines and then you can just scroll down and then use um, any of these you know this is the area where we talked about how you solve the clients problems so you can just use any of these I have a talent for researching and synthesizing information in a way that is interesting and easy to understand so you can use any of these you know just copy that and then scroll down and then copy any of these calls to action I mean look at this um, don't miss out on the opportunity to improve your website's traffic conversion rates and overall success click the order now button and let's get started I mean this is really good because we used this adjective a strong call to action these are strong strong call to actions because if you hadn't used this adjective strong you'd have gotten a different you know quality of results so while you're using chat GPT make sure you're using adjectives to tell it what to do okay if you wanted a funny call to action you just write uh, say write a funny call to action for my writing game but I think a strong call to action is more authoritative and just works so much better okay so in this video i've shown you how to write your fiverr gig description following three templates the first is grabbing the attention of your clients and mentioning the pain points the second is showing how you solve your clients problems and then the last is you know including a call to action if you gain some value from this video kindly like and subscribe